Well, hello there. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna eat Korean dogs. Woo! We went to Mochina and we got, I got a potato half and half. So do you want? Yes. Yeah. How to put the whole thing into it. Period. Okay. We got two potato half and halves, and we got a six piece of donuts. Let me oh see right here. Oh, it's this way. Before I drop them on, I'm gonna get one. <laughs> oh shit, I can't see. <laughs> <laughs> you can hey, you hold it. Yeah, hold it from the bottom. There we go. Oh, oh you <laughs> Wait, go it below here. Go it below. There you go. I think so. <laughs> I think they can see us. Oh, I can't see. Okay. Oh, shit. How do you come? Oh. <laughs> okay. And then yes. he got a Thai tea. Thai tea. And yes. I still have my coffee from Phil's Coffee, the best coffee shop in LA. Woo, Phil's Coffee. Mm. If you like the taste of coffee, it's the yeah, best yeah. coffee shop. If you like sweet coffee, <laughs> maybe not for you. How does it taste? It tastes delicious. Ah. Thai tea. I always get Thai tea when I get boba. Alright. This is what it looks like out of the box. Whoa. I'm excited. Okay. Our what? first bite. Cheers. Cheers. <gasps> mm. That's so good. I wish I would have put more of the spicy mayo. <laughs> Spicy mayo, it's really good. <laughs> mm. Hmm. Mm. This is not cheese. Mm. Mm. <laughs> I'm gonna cheese. Mm. Oh, that was good. I love these. They're my favorite thing ever. The place we went to is called Mochina. We have Korean <laughs> dogs, Boba, and Mochi, Mochi, Mochi nuts, Mochi donuts. Mm -hmm. They're so good. I think they're better than regular donuts. I don't know about that. Huh? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> yeah, the the mayo right here. And like your chin, chin, chin. Every time we do it in any, any, any it, what? Because you're dumb. Girl. <laughs> uh, what? <laughs> you interview me? <laughs> Every time we do an eating video, I'm always so messy. How the tables tables have turned. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. Oh, like, what message do they have in here? More than just a hot dog, always near you. Aww. Dear, then you can put your name on it. If you want to give it to somebody. Is it a gift? Mm. Is it a gift? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> can you give hot dogs as a gift? Mm. I'm say yeah. I think mine need a little bit more cooked too. Wow. Well. The dough is still there. Uh -uh. I can taste it. Might need a little bit more cook time. But, uh, I don't know. That doesn't hurt my stomach. <laughs> Will it hurt my stomach if I continue to eat it? You want me to take a bite so we can so both our stomachs get hurt? <laughs> it's, it's raw. It's really? Raw, it's raw there. Yeah, I don't miss raw. Uh oh. It does taste like raw. Does is yours not raw? Mm mm. No. The potatoes are good. Mm -hmm. That's unfortunate. But this side is cooked. I'm gonna eat the bottom. Mm -hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Gotta make it work with what you got. You know what I mean? <laughs> Things happen. I'm making this quick. We've been here before and usually this doesn't happen, so <laughs> I know it was an accident. <laughs> what was it really? Yeah. Mm. You know what it was? What? Because you didn't want to add sugar to your hot dog, that's right. Yeah, so it's just the bottom side of things with cheese. Yeah. Good. Mm. How do you make it work? You take it out, Miss Girl. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, you got the mochi nuts or whatever you call those things? Yeah. I need the wingers. The wingers. <laughs> the what? <laughs> That's what my sister calls them. The elbow part right here. She says it's my wingers. The what? <laughs> I told her to stop saying that because it makes me uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Okay. Try to take some of this ball. So, oh, I don't want to get sick. Can we get sick with that though? Yeah. I think so. Yeah. Huh? Did you do diarrhea? Mm -mm. I already have stomach problems. All right. I don't eat this anymore, guys, because fortunately the inside is raw. I'm trying to eat all the potatoes off right now. But I don't want to get sick, so what I had was delicious. <laughs> the best part. Some coffee. Ugh, I get full so fast. decide which one I want to eat. I think I want the chocolate. You want half of this one? Mm -mm. No. Yeah. I got the churros for me. Close, bitch. <laughs> Can I see? Well, I can't do it with one hand. Okay. I'm going to eat this one right here. And what is it? It's a chocolate fruity pebble. Ooh! Mochi nut. Fruity pebbles? Yeah. Cereal? Mmm. Mmm. Oh my god, so good. Mmm! Anybody else just love chocolate? Did you say chocolate? Chocolate! Mmm! A weenus. <laughs> That's been stabbed. <laughs> Alright, this potato covered in sugar. Look at this thing. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay. These mochi nuts are freaking delicious. Oh yeah, I think they're already close too. Mm -hmm. So hard to close. But it's over oh, with. Well, didn't even close right. Yeah. Mm. I squeeze it. I squeeze in what? Ten 
gonna help you. I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so what's the top? Oh, funky. <laughs> So what do you feel like talking about today? Hmm, I guess I'm more. <laughs> How is that one? It's good. Just take the extra though. It didn't have that churro crunch that I expected, but it's because it's a mochi nut. How's it gonna have a crunch? <laughs> it does taste like a churro though. Oh, that was so good. Coffee break? <clears throat> Ladylike. Okay, we can talk about what we were talking about yesterday. See what their point of view is. Which is? <laughs> okay, so yesterday I was asking him while he eats his churro <clears throat> mochino. Okay, I was asking him if he was ever, like, um, obsessed with anybody. Don't make that face. Mm -hmm. Don't. Wow, well, exposing. Don't. No, I'm just asking in general. Okay, because we were talking about it. I'm like, have you ever been, like, well, I told him, like, who was the person you were, like, obsessed with while you were a child? And I told him, I feel like everybody has one of those. You know, like, when you're in elementary and you're in kindergarten or first grade and you just like really have this like obsession over because it's not like a regular like middle school or high school like crush it's like this little kid obsession like you have there's no logistics for why you like this person you just you end up like falling in love with them and then you're just like obsessed with them and at first he didn't get me but then he was like oh yeah and it was funny because he was talking about how he was like, oh, yeah, I remember. When were you, what, what, what grade were you in? Fourth, I think. Fourth? Fourth grade. That's a little old. <laughs> I don't remember nothing past third grade. <laughs> okay. He, he was telling me, this is exactly what I'm talking about, how before, he before. he was okay. like obsessed. And when, when by obsessed, I don't mean like, you know, like, oh, my God, stalker, crazy person. No, but like, you know, like this infatuated. That's what I mean. Like, you're so infatuated by this person. So he was saying like, yeah, like he, he remembers being infatuated or obsessed, you know, little kid obsessions with this girl. And I'm like, okay. I'm like, how did you meet? And he was like, I never talked to her. And I was like, okay. So I was like, how did it happen? Was it like, oh, can you borrow a pencil? And then you were like, oh my God, I'm in love. And he was like, no, I just saw her outside. She wasn't even in my class. He said, I just saw her outside. <laughs> and then that's how it happened. And I was like, oh, so it was like those Reese's times that you see her and you're like, wow, she's so beautiful. And then you just became infatuated with her. He was like, yeah. And I'm like, and then he's like, yeah. And then there was this girl that was obsessed with me. And I was like, ew, get away from me. Did you, do you guys know what I'm talking about that? The like little kid infatuation that you have no reason for liking them. Like, like you never really talk to them. You, you barely like have you know you barely even spend time with them. You have no conversations, but for some reason you just looked at them. You said like one thing to them, and then you're like, "Wow, that's my person." <laughs> this whole delusional little world of a little kid. Let me know in the comments below if you know what I'm talking about. That little like infatuation as a child, where you're just obsessed for no reason with somebody you don't even talk to. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Thank you guys for joining us. I know the video was a little short, but you know, things didn't end up like expected. <laughs> um, a hot dog. I know. A hot dog. <laughs> <laughs> but it was good. <laughs> but thank you for joining us. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Be a supporter. And we'll see you next time. Bye.